Good morning, welcome back to a brand new weekly vlog. I'm just getting my shoes on because I'm running out to drop Tom off at the train station this morning. He's heading into Manchester. I'm not going in until Thursday this week when I meet Lydia and um, we're gonna shoot some outfits as per usual. Today is actually Tuesday. Um, yesterday I had pretty much just a chill at home day, like work kind of day. I got sunburn on Sunday at Mel's, which is a little bit tender so i'm just like keeping out the sun even though it's like amazing weather right now are you ready to go yeah. let's go sunshine sunshine makes me happy if you are new here please stick around and subscribe and give this video a like if you like my weekly vlogs leave all my social media channels down below if you want to come over to any of those platforms and say hi i'd leave tommy's but he doesn't have any tom doesn't do social media in fact i have quite a lot of like chores that i want to get done like clearing out sorting organizing and all that stuff if i get round to it am i driving right let's go so whilst i'm in town anyway i thought i would nip in and check out the sales So I didn't find anything in the sales, but I have grabbed myself Costa. It's now actually afternoon. I've been um, editing today's video, which was the jewelry haul, which went live. I did have a bit of a break in the sun, because why not? When the weather's like this, how can you stop inside all day, even with a sunburn? I'm just gonna head to Booze now, grab some dinner because tom is actually still in manchester he's not going to be back till probably a bit later so i'm gonna go grab myself some dinner now and chill out tonight that is the plan good morning it is thursday today and it's really sunny as you can tell outside it's very bright right now just had a delivery from lisa which is a new mattress we've ordered for our spare room like we're doing it up so i'm thinking of doing like a little transformation video like a before and after so yeah i think i might film that this weekend we'll see but today i'm off to um manchester to meet with lydia we're gonna go do some shooting of some outfits one second let me just pop that down this is not an angle that i'm proud of this heat i literally it just takes it out of me even just walking up the stairs then i'm like huh, exhausted uh, so i've just filmed a little instagram live let me know if you saw it and if not if you'd want to see more it was just of like me getting ready doing my makeup i still need to do my hair so i'm just gonna curl it i think <sighs> stay hydrated oh it's warm it's meant to be better for you warm water isn't it or like room temperature water i like it icy cold like with extra ice i've got my outfits ready to go and then we're also going to an event tonight with jeez we're also going to an event tonight with um a new area which has opened up next to pot kettle black in manchester as like a little workspace for if you want to go and have a meeting now so yeah that is what we're gonna do tonight it's a wild gin cocktail class with into the gathering dusk 
the place is called the Bake House and Boardroom. So I, I'll show you guys later when we get there what it looks like. But we're going to go with them to do this wild gin cocktail class. Even though we're both driving. So we're just going to have maybe a sip, a taste. And then not drink anything. Because I hate, like even though you're allowed to drink and drive. Like there's a limit. I still just don't like it. I would rather just not drink and drive. And then I will head back this evening in time for love island literally this dress i've lived in in this weather it's so like cool and light and definitely on the hunt for more of those um uh, but i thought i would just show you a couple of bits that i forgot to show you um well not that i forgot to show you but that i've received and that i thought i would show you just literally a couple of little bits in the post that i've received so you may have seen a couple of vlogs ago we went to meet a lady from avon who talked us through the new mark collection i say new it's probably not that new anymore but she's gifted me uh, i got these sent in the post but we got gifted them on the day so i'm going to put these aside to include them in the 20k giveaway when i eventually get there i've literally got a little bag going full of goodies for you guys um because you guys love the 10k one so much that I thought I'd do a 20k one. I think I'm about 17 now, so nearly there. Um, I also got, huh? <laughs> I also received this from a Borean Korean Skin Therapy, which they've sent me a couple of their products recently, and the glowing like primer base, I've used a couple of times and really like it. So this is called Copper Glow. It comes like so, in a little uh, duster bag, no velvet pouch and that is what it looks like nice gold packaging and comes with a little sponge and then there's a little cap over the top of it i thought that was alexa but it's the someone's radio outside so yeah that is what that looks like and then okay so a couple of jewelry bits they are from abroad i can tell by the packaging from a brand called Papa, so www.papaeast.com and inside is like a necklace which is a shame I've just done like a jewellery haul so it's too late to include these now but it's like a choker chain style necklace which I guess you can put on like so, so it's like layered it's got like a little gem on the end really really pretty and I like the fact that it's like a scoop versus straight <laughs> you know what I mean and they also sent me another little box with some more goodies in I feel like I sound quite nasally or like I've got a sore throat I've had a sore throat all of yesterday I don't know if it's hay fever or not but anyway I just ugh, ugh, you know that's how I feel um I also got this which is really cute I love the design of this it's like a chevron style gold really delicate bracelet i like how like it glistens in the light it's really pretty i feel like against nice tanned skin as a little simple bracelet on holiday just on its own or layered up could be really pretty these came in two separate bags but i think they're a pair of earrings yeah they are so this is what they look like they're quite dramatic again in gold because well i'm obsessed Oh, they are quite big, aren't they? I feel like you'd have to have a pretty minimal outfit, like just all white maybe, with these like statement earrings and no other jewellery. That's helpful. That's how I would wear them anyway. So yeah, thank you Papa East for sending me those. I'll leave a link to their website below if you want to check them out yourself. I feel like I'm talking like an Aussie. I think it's because I've been watching Love Island Australia which I'm loving. <laughs> it's so much more dramatic than I was on. Although, I said it's more dramatic than our one. It's definitely getting there, isn't it? Ours is ramping it up a little bit. Anyway, time to get my shoes on, pack the car up, and now I'm off to Manchester. We've arrived. Hello. There you are. It's so hot. <laughs> Very hot. We're both in pants as well at the minute. Which was really a stupid idea yeah. on a day like today, but... I've got a dress to change into tonight from Boohoo and this is pretty little thing, pretty little thing. It literally, as I was walking out the door to come here, the delivery woman arrived. So I was like, right, I'll gotta, take them with me. And I like them. This is like a scuba material, so it's really, really thick. So definitely love this. 
these I might need to size up and we'll see. Um, I like the colours there. Yeah, very me. <laughs> Beige and white. We're actually, we parked up a place called Pickford Street, is it? Pickford Street? Pick, Pickford, Street. Pickford Street, which is in like Ancoats Northern Quarter area. My friend, Celia, if you're watching, which you won't be, but she lives just around here. So um, I knew this area, I know it's quite quiet. We actually filmed our trailers near to here. And it's also very close to Rudy's Pizza, which I've heard a lot about. <laughs> yes! So we're gonna have some. I'm so hungry already. <laughs> diet stops today. Yeah. So well, we're... everything in moderation. Agreed. As long it's not as we weekend don't binge yet. on it. And well, it's not that bad. Do you buy a slice? Do you buy a full pizza? Oh, two slices. Oh. <laughs> right. Okay. So um, yeah, we're gonna photograph our outfits now, and then I will take you to Rudy's Pizza with us, and I'll also take you to the event. So we'll see you in a bit. See you later. Oh. <laughs> we're off. I love your little clip. Um, we're at Rudy's and look at this. Our food's just arrived. We decided to share because it is massive. It's pretty big. I just texted Tom because he was here last week and said to him, which one should I go for? He said, just get a margarita but get it to share because then it's big. Mm. For some reason, I thought you bought it by... Oh, I think I can advertise myself. <laughs> for some reason, I just thought you bought it by the slice, but yeah. Oh. I'm rubbish at this. Pressure's on. <laughs> it's a bit of a mad rush to get here. We're basically going to make some gin cocktails at Bakehouse and Boardroom, which is a new space for you to work, which is here. Irina's here. <laughs> Bakehouse and Boardroom. All right, let's go inside. This is in like the Button Arcade, if any of you are interested. tonic water that I have made with all the different goodies in it which you can see here on our little recipe card. In the interim we're sipping on Prosecco. <laughs> right so car officer's there, ticket officer so we're on time though aren't we? Yeah we're yeah. on time going to head back on. now back in time for love island of course and come um, over to my vlog while we're doing yeah well, an update yeah well i'll leave update. lydia's channel down below because oh, yeah but i will because you know oh god blazer down because we are together quite a lot and it'll be interesting to see look. lydia's content and the way that she does it no am i i paid for that I wish it was. <laughs> I wish it was. <laughs> Can I have it, please? No, um, yeah, I'm going to head back now. Lovely seeing you. I'll and see you next week. See you. See you next, next week, probably. Days. Potential trip to London oh, yeah. in a couple of weeks, which should be exciting. Oh, no, it's no, the it's beginning the of the week after. Okay. Oh, yeah. We'll see. Anyway, back. Oh, we're seeing each other Tuesday for that event with Hannah. Oh, yeah, Tuesday. All right, so next so, week. See yeah. ya. I can't kiss you because. I'll well, hug you because I'm holding on to my blazer. Stuff. Back home. Footies on. Boyfriend's here. Naughty. And I'm going to grab something that I've just seen Tom have. Whoa, what have you been cooking? Meatballs. My throat's a bit sore. Another one. Oh. I was just thinking that. What's that song? Another one. Yeah. So this is going to finish up tonight, obviously Long Island is on very soon and I'll catch you tomorrow. Good morning, today is actually Saturday, I feel like I've not properly vlogged this week just because it's been one of those weeks that like I've just been getting a load of admin-y type things done so 
nothing exciting, but today Tom is playing cricket. Are you going to get breakfast? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, say it again. No, it's a he says I look pretty. Ow. <laughs> Come on then, let's go grab some breakfast. Get up. Whoa. And this is our project for tomorrow. Considering Tom's playing cricket today instead of Sunday, we're going to get this bad boy out and start doing up our spare room, which I'll have a separate video for. A nice little picnic set up, enjoying the sun and breakfast, watching all the dogs. Yay. What tree is this? No idea. Willow, did you not used to swing on those no. when you were younger? Did anyone else do that? Find the long ones like that and just swing on them. Enjoying and finishing off my booze coffee. I'm gonna head back now, Tom's gonna get ready for cricket. And then I might just have a browse around some shops maybe and then come and watch you play later. You have a supporting girlfriend. Just as I was about to head out, I got two parcels delivered. So I thought I would just quickly open them before I head out. The first one's exciting. So it's from a brand called Feel Good Contact Lenses. I wear contact lenses every day. They reached out and actually asked if they could work with me. So I'm gonna feature these a lot more in next week's video. I'm gonna start off the week by trying out these different contact lenses and they are different colors. I'm gonna save this for next week and stay tuned for what kind of colored contact lenses I go for. And then I also got this delivered, which I don't know where this is from. Yes, okay. So last week, or was it a couple of weeks ago now, I went to a Bobby Brown event in Manchester and they gifted us lots of goodies, but their base products that we did, we did like a bit of a makeover masterclass. The base products that we used, they didn't have any samples on the day. So they took down our shades, color matched us and have sent us the base product. So it's part of the hashtag can't live without campaign. Okay, so the first one is the instant full cover concealer. My shade is ivory, and that is what it looks like. They also gifted us a corrector, which is something that I don't usually use. So this actually goes underneath the concealer. So this is in porcelain bisque, which is my shade, and it is probably one of the lightest, if not the lightest, just because I did say to them, I quite like bright under eyes. They have also gifted me the full cover oil free shine control it's got spf 15 in it this is the long wear weightless foundation beautiful packaging which you wouldn't expect any less from bobby brown they are just stunning they also have a pump there as well so that's handy and my shade is warm ivory and then this is probably my favorite product so they actually on the day we used two of these they are the foundation sticks and I've got warm ivory here, which is my actual shade, but they can also, you can also use like a darker shade to bronze up and kind of contour with. So this is in my actual like skin shade, but the bronzer one that I used was in almond. I'm very excited to use all of these base products as well. They are like the things that I get most excited about. <laughs> It's now evening time on Saturday and Tom has just left for the bar so he's going to go work. He does like works at his nightclub on Saturday nights. Because I've been out in the sun all day I'm pretty happy to just chill tonight. So he's literally just gone and it's like already nearly 10. And I'm kind of like in the ruthless clear out type mode tonight. So just for the next hour or so. So I'm just going to put some YouTube on and kind of just go through like a rough quick go through of things um, that I know for sure I want to donate as in they're not nice enough to like maybe sell to you guys on Depop and maybe things that like aren't bad enough to throw away something that I can donate and somebody else might prefer them but they're not branded or anything like that so that's what I'm going to do tonight I think just like a quick go through of everything I've already got my PJs on these little like silky PJs from misguided because it's so hot like I'm going to actually clip my hair up as well because having long thick heavy hair is not good in this heat <laughs> I don't want to complain because we complain all year round that it's miserable and cold but honestly, we're just not cut out for this weather. You can't cool down other than maybe like a cold shower. Happy Sunday, people. I am, um, little tip for when it's hot at night, I always just wet a flannel and just have it by my bed. So I can always just cool off in the middle of the night when I get 
too hot because this weather. This one. Um, I'm just going through this spare room today. This is kind of like my task in between uh, catching some rays and maybe going out for a stroll if I can drag Tom out of bed. He had a late night at the bar last night. I don't know what to do with our old mattress though. I don't know whether to just list it for free on Facebook for someone to come and collect it. Or if not, we're gonna have to like get a van or something and take it to the tip. For the rest of today, I am pretty much just going through, like I said, kind of decluttering a little bit, just tidying up in general and trying to decide on what to do with this room. So that is the rest of the day, unfortunately. I know uh, this week's weekly vlog has been a lot shorter than the rest of them, so sorry for those of you that really enjoy the long ones. I was contemplating not uploading. I thought better upload something and what we got up to than nothing at all. Yeah, sorry about that. I just have had a quiet week and I've also been a bit hay feverish and just not my 100% self. But um, yeah, hopefully next week will be far more exciting. I've got lots more planned next week. I'm going into London for a wedding. I'm going back down to my parents, see them, um, because it's like a family wedding that we're going to. I'm also in Manchester on Tuesday. So yeah, a lot more happening next week. But as for now, I'm gonna say goodbye and thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't already. I'll leave all the links to my social media channels down below and I'll see you very soon. Thanks for watching, bye guys.